awkward one. Maybe this a little more awkward one on this Harley Davidson shovel head, it's like an 82, you said? Yep. And there's no snap ring in here that we're used to, like from the last video we did on the master cylinder. So what we have is a built up assembly here, a bunch of little pieces. And what we're going to do, well, first off, we're going to take and uh, Harley Davidson DOT 5 for a lot of years. You got to be careful. Uh, you know, in class we talked about this that Harley Davidson does use DOT 4 on certain models. Anybody remember which ones? Bikes with anti lock brakes. Do you know that? Yep. Okay. You probably know it more than anybody. We have the famous, <laughs> infamous, get the camera on him, yeah. former Skills USA champion, third in the nation, Connor Brown, right. in the house. So here's what I think I'm going to do to be successful on this. Is I'm going to take, I found a socket of an appropriate size here. I'm going to kind of just feed this through and get this ready to go. Re try and line this up here. And then as I go down in here, Remember me kind of walking that around? Mm -hmm. And now I feel like I got good control. Looks like it's nice and even seated. We'll see if it shoots across the room at anybody. And so that popped under that lip in there. So it's just a friction fit on there. Now we're going to go ahead and be able to uh, <coughs> test it here. Here's a good thing too, grab the grease. I mean, this is that whole every mechanic, you know what I'm saying? People put this stuff in dry or whatnot. I'm on the non-fluid side, okay? So since I'm on the, the non-fluid side and I got metal going through rubber and into a piece of plastic, what would be great to be able to put on there? Some sort of loop. definitely a problem with these is that this people don't lubricate and clean these up enough okay so I want to get this good and clean so that that pin this should not be sticking in here this should be completely free okay to rotate right if that's binding on there that is not going to let that brake act free so the part that controls the plunger you can see that little uh, hole in there. So the piece that I just put in there, that tab needs to go in that hole. Something that's awesome for. Always use the new snap ring. Cap on. You want me to grab the screws? Yep. Uh, no, actually, you know what? No, just hold it. I'll just hold it like that. I'm going to prime it. Does that make sense? Yeah. Yep. I'm concerned about this because we had no... We had no break on this, okay? So... This thinking outside the box. Ooh. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. I am gonna shoot this all over myself. I'm facing <laughs> the wrong way here. Okay, alright, ready? Oh my god. Wait, my hit Connor. Oh <laughs> <laughs> But what a cool way to prove your work and not waste a bunch of time on the motorcycle. I always fill the reservoir, pump it up a couple times, and as long as I get the I've never had a master cylinder not work to full capacity on the bike.